Yo, it's your boy 12 the Black Fox 21 bringing you a Modern Warfare 3 gameplay. Uh this game this game <laughs> Call of Duty. We all know the name of it. We all know what it is. We all know that they have a different game coming out each year. We all know it's like the same as last year. But this game right here, nope, first of all, not a Call of Duty fanboy. We all know that I play every type of game mode. Every type of game mode. So I don't want to hear nothing in the comments about me being a COD fanboy. No. no but listen to me. Hear me out on this. Because I was with the crowd that Modern Warfare 3 was busted and it was going to be gay. But listen. I played it. My brother let me borrow it. This is not mine. So, yeah. This is not mine. But my brothers let me borrow it. But anyways, I played it. And I like it. Okay, now again, listen. This game to me is like COD 4 and Modern Warfare 2 mixed into one game and you know put with different movement and you know improved graphics and even though the, you know the graphics aren't that much better, but you know what I mean? Whoever worked on the multiplayer, I think it was Sledgehammer, I'm not even sure the who it was exactly, but whoever worked on the multiplayer did a pretty fine job. For more reasons than one. First of all, they brought back Gold Camel. Something that, you know, we all love. Everybody wants to strive and get that Gold Camel. It's, it's just something, you know what I mean? So, okay, yes, they brought that back. They brought back Theater Mode. Boom. I was waiting for this. I was hoping this game had Theater Mode. And I am glad that it does. Because, what what I'm, I'm going to show you. I'm going to add an extra clip in there. I think I, I will. I'm gonna add an extra clip of my of me like getting quick scoping and stuff. I love I love the clip and I love the clip. I hate the clip and I love it at the same time. It's laggy. First of all, let me tell you something. This the way I look. It looks like when I'm using the predator missile in the um, theater mode is not how it looks like when I use it in the real game. Cause like the Black Ops is theater mode. It's somebody else's perspective of how you played. You know what I mean? So um yeah, is it I it didn't look like that. I definitely it looked like I almost hit somebody, but that person was under something or something like that. But anyways, um what was I saying? Yeah, the quick scoping in this game. You know when you watch a Modern Warfare 2 kill cam and somebody aims it so quick you never even see the reticle? That's how it looks like in theater mode. And I and I might if I had the time plug the clip in in the end so you guys can see what I'm talking about. Um but yes, yeah, here Here's what I like about what they did with this game. Each gun has its individual level. Why this is great. Modern Warfare 2, you had to get headshots, a certain amount of headshots to unlock certain certain amount of camels. Not in this game. You just got to level it up by using it and getting kills with it and getting XP with that gun and it you know it goes on its XP bar and I think the maximum is 31. I'm not sure. But I know the UMP, you get gold at, at level 31, and I'm at 30 currently, so, you know, I'm almost there. But, um, yeah, you level up your gun. It's not even, it's not even like, you know, like I said, it's not headshots anymore. It, you leveling up your gun individually. This is good to me. I like this. Because there's some guns, you know, oh, oh, and I was also going, and Black Ops, when you wanted a camel, you had to buy the camel. Granted... Uh, some camels of these I wouldn't care I don't care for and that's where the black was black ops one had its actual it's um actually had its you know its plus side is because you could buy any other camels you wanted but the negative was that it was so ridiculous to get a gold camel it took you all the way to prestige 14 just to just to even get a gold camel and on top of that you had to save up 50,000 cod points to even get the golden gun that's ridiculous in this game level 31 with the UMP that's what I all I know level 31 and you get it granted level to get to level 31 doesn't take a quick time but does it take as long as a black ops no not at all that's why I like the camel part second thing I like the perks I love the perks I really do. People, some people don't like the assassin perk. I don't know why. I think it's just like cold blooded. If you ask me, I think it's just like cold blooded. Um, if anything, that is the cold blooded of this game. I'm, 
I don't know why people are hating on, you know, the perks, but whatever. Um, the perks are good. Then, you have the, um, kill streaks. The kill streaks are really good. First of all, there's no nuke. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, you can't get embarrassed at your skills for letting somebody get 20, or at least I think there's... My friend, Dirty999, told me about something about if you get 25 kills. I gotta look into that, but I'm not sure. Um, but anyways, the Osprey Gunner, the Attack Helicopter, you know, it's it's just basically Marvel for 3, Marvel for 2 without the nuke. And like, you know, a couple extra kill streaks. The, the remote, um, uh, the remote controlled, like, you know, helicopter that, you know, you can tag people and they show up on your mini map. I, I'm telling you, this game, I just find it, I find it fun. And I'm being serious. And like I said, I was with the crowd that Modern Warfare 3 was going to suck because it looked so much like Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. And I was like, I love Modern Warfare 2, don't get me wrong, but it had so many faults, it was ridiculous. So, uh, that's what I was thinking this was going to be. Th it proved me wrong. It proved me wrong. Um, anyways, I, I decided I'm going to add the extra clip in. So, we're, we're just going to look at this final cam. cam. Uh, it's nothing special. I've seen this because I recorded it. <laughs> yeah, but um, anyways, that's the thing. I wanted to jump into that. The sniping, real quick before this video ends. The sniping is amazing. I love the sniping. I am in love with the sniping. First of all, watch this. Collateral with lag. Please, can I get a standing novation? It was a quick scope. No hard scope, straight quick scope. Boom. I'm just going on a little tear right here. And you see that little lag 360? <laughs> A lag 360. Um, if you would have seen how I got that collateral, how you didn't see the reticle, but you saw like the scope going in, I thought that was sexy if you ask me. But anyways, yeah, like I said, the camo, the perks, the kill streaks, the leveling of the gun, uh, you know the the I, elites messing with me. It's like you know the service is not working you know, due to the volume of. Uh, it's not working for me. I'm actually really ex upset because I wanted to use this and start my clan up through Elite. Um, that it, that's not working. But um, the the campaign was all right. It was quick as I don't know what. I beat it in literally two days of only playing for like like you know five hours each. It, it was it was not it was not long at all. But anyways, I'm gonna wrap it up right there. Um. You know, the game's good, get it. Wait, hold on, let me not say get it. If you if you don't like the previous Call of Duties, you might not necessarily li like this one. I'm just saying I like this this Call of Duty and I think it's good. So anyways, it's your boy 12 the Black Fox 21 signing out. Peace. Make sure you follow me on Twitter and make sure you know you just keep in touch.